Hi, my name is Leon Rowe, currency trader and trading coach at trading180.com. And in this video, we're going to really explain why this uh, demand zone uh, didn't work right here. I mean, it did here. Mo many traders um, who trade uh, supply and demand, uh, just from from a technical perspective, uh, you know, may have uh, made a bit of money, but on the pullback and the fresher area of demand right at the bottom, why didn't this work, right? A lot of traders will um, uh, not really understand that technical traders anyway, will understand that fundamental analysis is really the reason why uh, supply and demand or any technical strategy will work. You really need to understand the, the fundamentals behind why price is moving the way it is. And there's no technical level, whether it's supply, whether it's demand, whether it's support, whether it's resistance, whatever indicator you can think of is not gonna work if it's going against fundamentals or risk sentiment analysis. And so, um, the reason why is because uh, of blockbuster jobs reports to push Fed to hike and keep rates hike, uh, high. So we had uh, on the 3rd of February non-farm payrolls come out and the, the data was uh, fantastic, right? So let's zoom in, that was the 3rd of February. The data was fantastic, but what does that actually you know, mean? Really what it means is that the jobs means that the economy is doing um, okay or doing well um, as the, the numbers were fantastic and the impact of that means that the Federal Reserve can or gives license to the Federal Reserve to continue hiking rates and hiking rates typically uh, appreciates a currency. Now currencies are trading in, traded in pairs and so it's not a 100% guarantee at the moment. It depends on who is hiking more and uh, who's hiking bigger than another um, bank, right? Just because one bank is hiking, if it's you know against another bank that is uh, hiking um, um, even more and for longer, then um, the, the 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 central bank that is hiking for more and longer will be in the uh, will try to appreciate their currency and and that currency should appreciate against the one that is not hiking as much and is maybe not hiking for uh, as long. So, with that being said, it gave license to the Fed to uh, put a higher rate peak on the table, which means that they are uh, can hike. Uh, the market is expecting them to hike an extra. 25 basis points, which then means that they, the currency should appreciate, which is basically what is happening right now. Now, how much it will appreciate is another story, but that's beyond the scope of this video. Um, what I'm just talking about is why this level, yeah, why this level of demand did not work and why levels of supply and demand or certain levels of supply and demand don't work and why some do. And it's really imperative to your technical trading that you understand what is going on behind and beyond what price is telling you, right? You can see with your eyes, everyone can see what's going on in the price chart, but it's what is going on beyond what you don't see that is really moving price, especially over the medium to long term. And even in the short term, price is really driven by uh, liquidity, market making, and the such. Anyways, uh, hope you found that useful. Um, take care and to all those uh, fundamental naysayers, I'm gonna keep making these videos to prove to you that fundamental analysis is what is driving the market. Anyone who says that technicals, you know, all you need is technicals, um, you know, I believe that they are, uh, <laughs> they're wrong and I'm gonna prove it. Anyways, take care until the next video. Tell me what you think, if you do think that technicals you know, are the reason why, you know, I'd love to hear your case, but, um, you know, I've, I've got the proof as to why fundamentals and understanding and having a deep understanding of fundamentals is really the reason why either levels will work or they won't work. Anyways, take care. Have a great trading week. I'd uh, love to hear your comments and feedback and uh, all the best to the next video.